Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the removal of the Google account lock on an Android device. Also known as the FRP lock, it's something that Google initiated back in Android 5 to where when a device is factory reset without first removing the Google account that's on it, it's then going to ask for you to log into that account again as a security measure after the factory reset is completed. Now, here with us today, we happen to have a Samsung Galaxy Tab S4 and this is one that does have the Google account lock enabled. As we can see here, as we're going through the setup process, we get to this screen that says that the device was reset. And to continue, we need to sign in with an account that was previously on the device. So it will not let us sign in with just any uh, Google account. So we've been contacted by tons of customers from all over the world asking for help with this specific device with the Google account lock, either because they got themselves locked out accidentally and didn't know their Google information to be able to get back in, or because they were sold the device by a dishonest seller who did not tell them that the lock was enabled on the device. We're making this video to let all of our customers know that we do offer a service to be able to remove the lock from this model device. We've actually already done 99% of the work here, so we just have to do a restart and then after that, once it boots up, we should be able to see that we can indeed get all the way through the setup steps without seeing that Google lock there. While it's booting up, I should mention that this is something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world, as long as you have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection. So you do not necessarily need to be located here in our area in order for us to be able to do this for you, because if you meet the requirements, we can just connect to your computer remotely through the internet and do the exact same step that we did here to this one. So it is all set up to go here. We are at our welcome screen, the start screen here after the device has been reset. So we're gonna start going through all of the steps here. We're gonna agree to the terms and conditions. And let's see, we don't need Wi-Fi, so we can skip that. And then we're gonna wait. It's gonna tell us date and time. We're gonna go next. We're gonna skip the Google services. It's gonna ask us about a screen lock. We don't need to do that so we can skip it. And these are all very good signs because we could never get to these screens before when it was locked. We're gonna skip the Samsung account because we don't need one. And we're gonna tap finish and then we should Yep, there we go. So we are now at the device's home screen. We have full access to all the apps and features and settings, and it's just like a brand new device that never had the lock on there. Let me jump into the settings real quick, and we'll go ahead and show you exactly what we're working with. So under the About section, we can see that we do indeed have here a Tab S4 with that model number of T830. That's the specific model that we are working with here today. So if you have a Galaxy Tab S4 that has the Google account lock enabled and need help getting rid of it, we would love to help you out with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all the information there as well. While you're here, make sure to check out all the other videos that we have on our channel as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices. And I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy. Make sure to hit that subscribe button while you're there also to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding, just like this one. Y para todos los hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.